and we are going to begin with Duke at Notre Dame. That is going to be a 7 o'clock Eastern tip-off at Notre Dame. The Blue Devils open minus 13, totals 151. Now, if you like Duke laying double digits on the road here, just keep in mind they're taking on a Notre Dame team who's 46th in offensive rebounding. They're 11 and 4 straight up at home. Meanwhile, on the Duke side of things, they failed to cover in four out of their last five. And believe it or not, they rank only 180th in defensive rebounding in the country. Now, when it comes to the total, Duke's 60% to the over in their last five. Notre Dame's all, uh, offense is scoring 75 points per contest. So with all that said and done, I'm going to lean Fighting Irish plus 13 in the over 151 in that matchup there. Next game, TCU at Texas Tech. 9 o'clock tip-off at Texas Tech. The Raiders open 5.5 down to minus 5. Total open 131 up to 132. Texas Tech is 6-3 and three straight up in their last nine. They're also 12-1 and one straight up on their home court. The Raiders rank second in the nation in home defensive scoring, first in home field goal percentage allowed, and second in defending the three ball on their home court. Now, TCU ranks 128th in road field goal percentage. They've also failed to cover in three out of their last six games. When it comes to the total, TCU is 60% to the over in their last 10, taking on Texas Tech. So with all that said and done, I'm going to take Texas Tech minus five in the over. 132 in that one. All right, next and final game for our college slate. It is going to be Baylor at Oklahoma. That is going to be a 9 o'clock tip-off at Oklahoma. The Sooners open 7.5 down to minus 6.5. Total open 140 down to 137 and a hook. The Sooners are 3-0 against the spread in their last trio of ball games. 8-2 against the spread in their last 10. The Sooners are 10-1 straight up at home this season. And they uh, have successfully covered the number in 9 out of those 11 ball games. Now Baylor on the other side, they rank 171st in scoring, 204th from the stripe, and 231st from beyond the arc. Now when it comes to the total, uh, Baylor 6-1 and one to the over in their last seven, Oklahoma 80% to the over in their last five. So with all that in mind, I'm going to purchase the hook, slide it down, and take the Sooners minus six in the over 137 and a half in that matchup there. All right. Next 